morning. Um, if you're new here, I'm Janie. If not, welcome back. Today we're gonna do a little hair vlog. I'm getting my hair done, but before that I have a bunch of errands to do. I have been getting Neosculpt or Msculpt, one of those on my legs. Um, it's supposed to help like tone your legs because I have from weight loss, I have a lot of loose skin and stuff and like my glutes never grow. I just have like, that's my stubborn area. So I wanted to try it. Um, but they said, I, I haven't talked about it on here because I wanted to give it a long enough time to see if I've actually get results from it. And they say like six weeks after your last treatment, that's when you'll know. And also like in the meantime, I, I have been trying to eat a little bit better. I'm still working out. If you follow me on Instagram, I work out, do strength training four days a week. So I'm doing that like on top of that stuff. Like it's not like that's a quick fix, but so far I haven't noticed a difference and it was pretty pricey. So that's why I just want to like wait to be sure before I talk to you guys about it. But today we're just going to do like a whole full day vlog. Um, Come with me to that. I'm not going to bring you an M sculpt. All I sit there and they put the machine and it like contracts on your skin. It's like uncomfortable. It doesn't hurt, but it's definitely not fun. Um, I just scroll on my phone or watch a YouTube while it's going on. It's a half hour, so it's not too bad. And then right after that, I'm going to try my hardest to run to UPS. I got all my returns. So I really want to try my hardest to run to UPS and then I have my hair appointment. So I'm going to eat a Built Bar this May. For me, I had a yogurt and then I had a Built Bar this morning and then I just grabbed one when I was running out the door because I had one early. I just did, I've been doing on the treadmill on Wednesdays. I do 30 minutes at a 13 incline at three miles per hour and holy cow like it burns and like I am dripping in sweat but it feels so good after but like then after I'm starving so right after I had a yogurt and a built bar but now I'm like hungry again so I might just I don't have time to stop for anything and I don't like to eat more than one a day but I might just because of the circumstances have another and then after this I'm gonna try to run to UPS and then I want to go to Starbucks and get one of those like egg sandwiches because then I'll be in my hair appointment for a couple of hours. So it's gonna be a fun day, but I always get questions on my hair color and all right now don't judge me for it because it's so messy. But um, so I just figured I would take you along with me. I don't even know what that's what I'm gonna be doing during this Sculpt appointment. I'm gonna try and figure out what I wanna do with my hair because I have really dark roots and oh, you're turning. And I just like, I don't know. I feel like this time around, I'm like, oh, I can't wait for my appointment. It looks so bad. I don't know. And I'm just using, I didn't even have time to fill up my Stanley. I'm just using a good old blender bottle. All right, but that's the plan. So you'll be along with me for the ride. I'm gonna eat this now and hopefully make it to my appointment. Not too late. I'm not gonna be on time. We already know that. We are just cruising along. So I actually went to Starbucks. Um, I just got out of my M Sculpt and I got, how pretty it is. So this is the Venti white chocolate macadamia cookie crumble on top. You can kind of see on top. Well, I guess you can't really see in there. There's cookie crumbles. And I do, instead of the macadamia syrup, syrup I sub it for sugar-free vanilla. And then I also get a splash of almond milk in here. So good. And then I got two, no one judged me, because I'm hungry. I got two um, of these turkey bacon sandwiches. These are so good. I wish I had ketchup though. I should do it back, but I don't feel like going back in. And then Starbucks had samples. So this will be my after lunch breakfast treat. It's a little brownie. And then they also had a sample of this drink. It's definitely like some sort of mocha drink. It's good, but I don't love it. I could have done without that one. But I'm excited to try the brownie. So we're gonna sit here and eat these. Hot, but I was hungry. And then I'm gonna head into my hair appointment, which is right here. I have half an hour, so I think I'm gonna actually do some work on my phone. This is actually turning out, I start today started off rough, and I was like, I'm not gonna have a bad day. 
and this is starting to be a very productive day so i am very happy with the way things are going but now i'm gonna have my breakfast in the car people are probably like who are you talking to my friend and i'll see you at my hair appointment okay. dave's complaining because i wasn't supposed to be home today because i had errands around but i wanted to show so here's my hair the final product she did like a 90s blow out on it I really like it. You like it? I do like it. Peter, did you notice I got my hair done? No. It's cool. the same. It's just more straight. Anyway, now we're on our way to get Nico, Luca, and Ava, and then we're going to go to this local candy shop called oh. Sweet Revenge. You did tell me. I forgot. Tell you what? Dave was about how we were going somewhere and I like totally forgot. We talked about it last night. Yeah, you aren't getting any. <laughs> yeah, but last night Peter said, he was like, I don't want any candy. So I was like, all right, we're going to this place and the girl said we could pick out whatever we want and Peter doesn't want any. So I guess he's just too cool for candy now. You're not even gonna get one little thing? Depends what they have. Uh, nope. If it's like something you need, that they don't have in candy shops, then they might get it. It's like a homemade candy shop. It's not like where you're gonna find like Snickers and stuff. Oh, they need the all. Oh, the Josh. Yeah. We're going to the candy store. It's beautiful out, and then there's Rosie's where we're gonna get pizza. Eva, say hi. Hi. That's Raj dipped in caramel, rice krispies, and chocolate. Too bad your mom doesn't like chocolate. I know. It's the weirdest thing to me. Pokemon Pops? Yeah, I know. But look, look what we just got. This thing is so cool. So this is what they're known for. It's their pizza. I'm gonna help you, babe. Ava has her little bag. Hold this on, honey. probably the best flavor. What? Dark chocolate coconut. No, I like pistachio. Or no, the milk chocolate caramel pretzel. Look how good this looks. It all comes, you can get individual slices or a whole one. They were so nice here, but it's Sweet Revenge Custom Chocolate right on Bay Up and Point. And then Dave's at Rosie's right now seeing if our pizza's ready, which there's no way it's gonna be ready yet. Which they also, if you're ever in Point Pleasant, they have excellent pizza. You could, I think this pizza's better. You think so? Look nice. at this pizza. This is from Rosie's. It's I so good. It. I know Peter's getting scissors. We also got salad and their meatballs. I don't think I can open this. We're gonna eat outside. I can't open it. Ooh. Yummy. Wait, hold on. We're gonna cut it. It's probably still hot. We're gonna eat outside here. The pizza now. How is it, honey? Yeah. Ooh, this one is good, but it's not crispy. No. Wow. Very thin. Yeah. Hmm. How is it, Eva? Good morning. I just had breakfast, which is at oats. Don't mind this. My hair is crazy. I'm trying to clip it out of the way so I can throw on some makeup. Um, and then I'll re-dry it so I can actually show you because I realized after I got out of my hair appointment yesterday, I just was, we like got in the car with Dave and rushed off and at the house we had guys here working. So I like, there was no room that I can go in and show you after, but after I put on some makeup and throw my hair, throw my hair, brush out the dry shampoo, I'll show you. But we're just going to do a light look today. I actually have prom hair today. So if you didn't know this, I was a hairstylist for 10 years. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Longer than 10 years. 13, 15? Because Peter's 12. I was a hairstylist for a while, and I worked at a salon down here for 10 years. Um, and I quit in December to pursue my other career full time. So, but my one client who turned into my babysitter now, I did her, her mom, her sister, and like then we just became friends because I was doing, I did all of her prom hair, all of her dances hairs. Um, I've just like been a part of their life for so long and I've done 
all of their hair for so long and then she became, I asked her, I was like, can you babysit Ava? And now she's been babysitting for us for over a year now. And we absolutely adore her. Like she is such, she's going to, she's gonna be, a, well, she is a school teacher. She just graduated and now she's a school teacher. So it's just crazy. Like I remember talking to her mom when she was thinking about going away to college and like all of her plans and stuff like that. So it's just crazy to see. But now her younger sister is, it's her last prom, which is insane. So I was like, of course. She was like, will you still do it? I'm like, of course I'll do it. Like that's just, it's so nice. Like we've formed such a bond, so I'm so excited. But Ava went to school today and I think I'm gonna pick her up early because I know she's gonna wanna see, um, the girl's name is Kelsey. I know she's gonna wanna see Kelsey in her dress because she's gonna like look like a princess. So we're gonna do that in a little bit. So I'm gonna get ready. I have some things to do for work. I'll show you my hair and then it's on to prom hair. I wanna get it set up and make it cute downstairs for her. Can't offer her a drink or anything, not that I even drink, but like it's not like a wedding where you have mimosa, it's prom. <laughs> I'll offer her a seltzer and orange juice. Okay, so this is the hair. I mean, it's second day, but she just did it yesterday. All we did was a partial highlight and I actually got like an inch, two inches off because she did really cut into like the face frame area a lot and then she just cleaned up these like oversized bangs I have going on. And then she said she glazed my hair with 10P9 Redken Shades Gloss, by the way, 10P9V. And then she said a baby dot of 7P. That's exactly what, because there was another girl there and she's like, what did you glaze her with? So that is my exact formula, if you're wondering. But yeah, I really like it. It needed a good, healthy chop. Now I'm gonna get dressed and I will show you the stuff I got from American Eagle. I got some goodies and Aerie. Okay, so here's everything I got from American Eagle. So I got another pair of these are the best mom jeans. And I'm just going to show you this real fast. And then I'm going to pop up a TikTok that I did of trying all this stuff on. But these are the exact ones I get. The Strigid Mom Jeans. Super high rise. Love those. Um, I got this tank, which I think I'm going to wear today, actually. Some jean shorts. These I'm returning. They were way too small and too short. These I loved. The baggy wide like Oh, maybe I'll wear this. I'm going to wear that today. <laughs> Um, these shorts I didn't care for, those are going back too. And then some, these I love, these baggy wide like pants. These were from Aerie, they're the beach linen pants. And then I actually got two more pairs of the cargo pants, I love those. And this is from Aerie too, it's like a hangover thing, but I will show you that. And then these, I already have two of these cargo pants. I, I wore this color yesterday and I got so many compliments. So I love these, true to size, super cute, and I'll pop up that TikTok now. A big American Eagle box, so let's do a little try and haul. I actually ordered another pair of jeans that I already know are in this box. Jeans, I'm not gonna try them on again because I literally have them on already and they are the best jeans. So I ordered a second pair because I love them that much. They are the Strigid Mom Jeans, true to size. I got a super wide leg baggy jeans from American Eagle in white. I say they're true to size. If not, they run like a little bit big, but I absolutely love them. I did not think I was gonna like these. These are the high rise baggy shorts. I forget this top. I'm gonna have everything on my like to know it where I'll put the link in, the, in my bio. But I don't know, something about this is just off. It's giving wild thornberry. So these are, I really wanted to like these. I just feel like they're not flattering at all. This, I just wanna get it off. These are the baggy wide leg pants. And these I absolutely love. I don't know how to describe the material. They're super soft and comfy. I was hoping not to love so much stuff. Last item are these cargo jeans. I absolutely, or cargo pants. I absolutely love these. I already own them in green. And I just think they're so flattering. They're definitely true to size. And I just think they're like not too baggy, not too tight, just like a flattering. And you could pull the drawstring at the bottom to make them tighter, but oh, my wallet's hurting after this one because I loved literally everything I got. Here's what I'm wearing today. So these are those pants. They're so comfy. And then this shirt was literally, I think it was like $9.99. It was 
on sale for so cheap. But now I like desperately need to go down and do some work. I also just got this package of storage bins that I want to go through. I have so many like makeup, like hair products that I want to organize them in these so I can see them. But I keep this, I always do this. I keep getting distracted and then I get nothing done. So I need to go down and get work done and get my butt moving because I have like an hour and a half before I have to start the prom hair. Today's gonna fly by. Wait, so I wanted to show, wait, this is gonna be bad lighting. Let me bring you somewhere where I can show you. We also just got this big package in the mail. Um, wait, let me show you that first. Do you see that out there? <laughs> That's a shed that Dave told me not to order that I ordered. Um, but I just got this from Amazon. Talk about the perfect free people dupe and it even has that little like zipper in the back there. But I was just about, I grabbed an Alani new because I'm going to do some more work in the office. And I set up all of the hair stuff so it's all ready for when Kelsey gets here in like five minutes. <laughs> Honey, I was just talking about you. You know where he is? The bathroom like always where all dads and... <laughs> Why are you making that face? Give me a plunger. <laughs> I was just telling them about the shed. Yeah, cool. Yeah, for it's Father's Day, I got a job. Cool. Surprise. Yeah, It'll surprise. Busy. More you should shit. do it today with the guys. No, I have shit to do. You just ditch. <laughs> I just finished doing the prom hair. I will pop up a picture. It came out so good. I just. She's so sweet. I just love her. She's like so naturally beautiful too. Cause I was like, are you getting your makeup done? She's like, no, I'm just gonna like do a little myself, which I love that because I like, well, like, I don't know. I'm such a mom now. Like when you look more natural, I think that's so pretty. What in the world? So I was just like, would it be a YouTube if I didn't do an unboxing? Are you kidding me? What? Lappy Taffy? This isn't real life right now. Oh my god. Sorry, I just put the box in your face, but I'm just in shock. Fruit combos. Ooh, mango passion fruit. Oh my god. What is this one? Oh, so there's a bunch in here. Strawberry, orange, fruit combos. There's, oh, there's jokes on every wrapper. I feel like this is their dad thing. Well, I should probably open the card. <laughs> dad thing. So it's for dad. Oh my gosh. On June 18th, aka Father's Day, starting at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, while supplies last, families can visit www.laffytaffycombos.com to share their top combo of dad things about their fa father figures, and dads will receive the new Laffy Taffy fruit combos. Oh my gosh. That is so, so nice. So it's laffytaffycombos.com. I want to try them, but like, I feel like maybe I should wait till Dave since it's a Father's Day one now. I'll wait for him. The boys are going to freak out too. Oh, maybe I'll just save it for Father's Day. Maybe I'll do that because he's outside now. So, okay. So we're in the car. The air is blasting. Sorry if it's loud, but it has to be. But I just went to the bank because I had to open a business checkings account, which I never had before. But now that like I have a business, I registered like an LLC. It's simply Janie. Um, well, I registered it last year, but I just never opened a business account. But like now I realized grown up stuff is something I need to do because I was a hairstylist for ten, well, over 10 years, 10 years at the last place. So I always just got like a paycheck and I never like worried about anything like that. But I was like, I need a business account and all that. So I was just at the bank and it took way, the guy was so, so nice, but it took way longer than expected. So I have my little like business card with my LLC on it just exciting grown-up stuff but I got that done I felt so bad because he had like such a long line behind him and he was just him and like my stuff was taking forever and it wasn't even like there was nothing we could do it was just all the forms like he needed me to fill out I didn't realize that was that much of a process and then Dave just called me and he's like me and check my location and I'm like why <laughs> he's like me and Ava are having a daddy daughter date which I I have FOMO so I hate that because I get so jealous and he took her 
Oh, this guy's backing out. Um, he took her to get ice cream, but meanwhile it's 4.45. I'm like, I was about to go home and make dinner. So I guess we're having ice cream before dinner, which honestly that happens quite. So I'm gonna head home. I might just pick up dinner. I don't even know. Like she's not gonna be hungry now for a while, but whatever. I think it's so cute that they did a daddy daughter date. I love that. So I'm gonna wrap this vlog up now because we're gonna head home. We're gonna have ice cream. I might show some clips of that, but Thank you for being here, and I will see you guys in the next vlog. Look at these cuties. I... Not, he's not a cutie. Daddy's not a cutie? No, I'm a cutie. Only you are. What's daddy? Daddy's a boy. <laughs> <laughs>